my gosh. I just woke up. 2.30 p.m. I work nights. And uh, just had some random bursts of motivation because they are having the Bath & Body Works sale, the candle sale today. And my mom texted me and was like, can you please go and see if they have something for me? And I was like, you know what? This is my affirmation from the universe to go to Bath & Body Works. I really cannot be like buying this stuff though. Like I have so many candles. That's like the thing as an adult. Like I thought that like the perfect way to complete your house is just have like a Bath and Body Works candle. And I always felt like an adult when I was a kid. If I had a candle in my room, like going, but we're gonna go do that. And then I'm going to a ugly sweater party tonight. I'm excited. It's kind of hard to care what you look like, but I'm just trying to be comfy and get those candles. So let's go. This is the first time going out for like Christmas shopping, I guess. I'm kind of scared. I don't want to wait in a line. I'm gonna start getting ready for this party, I guess. Got my wine. Do you guys put ice in your wine? I feel like it's so satisfying. I never tried it until that Bruno Mars song. Strawberry champagne on ice. All right, I'm gonna get ready. So I um, was introduced to lo-fi music this year. I don't know why, like, I never looked into it before, but, like, it's so satisfying. So, like, lo-fi is great, like, whatever. Like, those live streams of, like, the lo-fi girl studying. So satisfying. And then I feel like I, like, unlocked an achievement in my brain because I found out that artists that you like have lo-fi remixes. Like, people make remixes for everything. So I'm listening to a Black Bear lo-fi remix right now, and it's just, like, so satisfying. I know there's a Mac Miller one. There's definitely an Ariana Grande one. I've listened to a couple of those. They're all so great. It's just so relaxing. So while I do my makeup, I am burning my relax. It's so cute with the little moon. I don't know. Just giving me very feminine energy vibes. But yeah, life is crazy. Like, I'm in such a weird spot. I feel like my life is just like moving without me really like thinking, you know? Like I just go through the motions so easy here. And I hate to say that, but also like it's kind of the only thing that's getting me through. Also like giving myself like things to look forward to is really helping. I'm going home for Christmas, which is gonna be exciting. See all my friends. We might get a dog next year. We decided like we didn't wanna do Christmas presents for each other. We just wanted to get a dog cause that's gonna be an investment. Then after that, like, we're trying to move. This apartment's raggedy. So I'm giving myself things to look forward to and trying to really help myself. There's a lot of really good YouTube videos I've been watching and listening to that have been helping me with, like, my struggles in life. If I don't stop talking, I will never finish it. Real quick, these eyebrows. I am, like, starting to master, like, the more straight brow. I'm trying to give myself that lifted look. Be in it. Oh my gosh, you have pants on. He acts like he's naked. That was probably the least amount of stealth. I look ratchet. I just got off work. Thank you.
you guys everything I got for Black Friday week. Basically the mall and everywhere around here did just a week sale, um, which is great because then I could kind of do it on my own time and it didn't have to be on Black Friday early in the morning. So all right, I'm gonna start with Ulta and I ordered this online and it came pretty fast. You guys saw some of this already, but I got this headband for um, like makeup. It's like a makeup headband and towel material and it's like a cute like vintage bow looking. Yeah, it's super cute. I really like it. And then I got this clip. These are like super in right now. Um, and I think just a smaller one is good for my hair because my hair is not as long or thick. I got a little pencil sharpener for lip pencils and eyeliner. And then I got these lashes, this three pack. This three pack, um, this was only like $10, which is a super good deal. And then this was also $10, the Benefit Roller Lash. Pretty good. This is like a 20 some dollar mascara, so I'm really happy I got it that um okay next i went to plato's closet um they don't they didn't really have like a sale you know everything there is pretty cheap so i got this leather skirt this was six dollars um and it's from h&m so i got these pants i love them so much they're giving me like black bear meets clueless vibes they're from luna chicks which is just like some random brand that you'd probably find at like um, tj maxx or something i love the way they fit they're just a little high-waisted and they're not super long. And then I got this shirt, super cute. It's like mesh. It would be really cute with like a tank top under and it's from Victoria's Secret and it was $12. So a little bit more expensive. Oh, the pants were like eight bucks. So next I got yesterday, the Bath & Body Works candle sale. I am actually really happy I got this bag, super cute. And I bought five candles, so I spent about $55. Candles are normally about $25 a piece, so if I would have bought five full price, it would have been like $125, $130. That's a pretty good deal. Um, I'll just start off with this one. This is actually what I'm burning right now. It's Marshmallow Fireside. Um, I am obsessed with this candle. There is something about it that smells like nostalgic to me. I don't know what it is or why, but it's really good. And I like to kind of stock up on the Christmas ones because, you know, you can only buy them like once a year. So I'm, you know, going to burn the rest of that one and then that'll be my backup. The next Christmas candle I got was the classic Twisted Peppermint. I really love this packaging because it has a little, it has a little wiener dog on it. I think that's so cute. This smell is super nostalgic to me because it's a really old Bath & Body Works Christmas scent and it just for years i've had this scent in my life mom would always buy me the twisted peppermint body care for christmas because she knew i loved it and also like the first house that i lived in when graden and i like first kind of got together and he would come over a lot i always had that candle burning and it's really nostalgic in that way next i've already burned this a little bit <laughs> but this is the aromatherapy relax it smells like chamomile it's a very relaxing like it's probably good for like a nighttime. It's giving me those nighttime vibes because it's got the little moon on it. It's so cute. I'm obsessed with the aromatherapy. It's so good. Um, next, I got some perfume scent. So like the body care scent. This is a thousand wishes. Can you see it? Super pretty packaging. It's so beautiful. And um, thousand wishes is just like a really sweet girly the notes are sparkling champagne crystal peonies almond cream and natural essential oils i definitely smell that peony um it's so good so amazing um and then the last one i literally died when i saw this i flipped out because this is my favorite scent ever for body care and i've never seen this candle before into the night oh Oh, except I'm kind of upset because I feel like the black lid would look better on it, but it's so, mm, so good. And the notes are sugared raspberry, velvet rose petals, shimmering amber, creamy musk. I don't know how much I will like that, probably on like special occasions or unless I find another one soon. But I feel like the crazy candle girl from Scream Queens. Have you ever watched that show? 
this chick and she literally gets murdered like while she's vlogging the candles that she just bought. Three Hills Mall and the girl was like, sorry, we did have Mrs. Claus's cinnamon brown eye in the back. It was just hidden behind a whole bunch of stuff because it's seasonal. <sighs> it's me, dang it. This last one I'm really excited about. I actually haven't even opened it yet. It is from Salon Centric. So this website is for licensed hair stylists and my sister is licensed. So she let me use her login to buy something. I got the Olaplex stuff. So excited. Apparently this is like the best stuff you can use for your hair, like the best system. I spent $60 on four things, which is crazy. So first, this is the number eight moisture mask. All hair types, it says moisturizes, smooths, adds body and shine. Then I got the number zero intense bond building hair treatment. So incredibly excited. And then I got the number four and number five shampoo and conditioner. I'm really excited to try this, except I just no, you're not supposed to use it like every time you wash your hair, if you wash your hair a lot, but use every time you shampoo. I don't know, I don't know, but I'm hoping that I can get my hair to where I don't really like wash my hair a lot. Like I wash it like two or three times a week now. So if I could like use this twice a week and then like the mask like once. I just heard that it has so much protein in it that it can actually make your hair break off if you use it too frequently. That is, all I got, um, except, no, I take it back. I ordered a pair of black leather pants from Depop and they still have not shipped and that was last week. So I should probably message her again. But besides that, that's all I got. And I'm gonna do my Christmas shopping for my friends and family when I get home. I am going back to Indiana in a little less than two weeks. I'm so excited for Christmas. So probably do shopping there so that I don't have to like mail or like pack everybody's presents from down here. So that's gonna be really exciting. Tis the season. I think the rest of the night I'm going to make some popcorn and just snuggle up and watch a Christmas movie or something and celebrate Christmas and the fact that it is a weekend and I'm not at work. That's a big thing to celebrate.